Welcome to my video. I'm so glad you are here today to join me for this video. I have some cleaning motivation, I have some laundry, I have some packing, and I have some pantry and refrigerator cleaning out. So if you want to join me in cleaning, this is a great motivator. So put it on your phone, put it on your big old TV, and let's get started. I know. This video spans over the course of several days. This is just a random day that I decided the pantry and the refrigerator had to get cleaned out. It was driving me insane. So I just put up a tripod and I finally cleaned out the pantry and the fridge. There's so many reasons you should care The sun is setting down soon You'll never see the stars when you're all in your head You can find beauty in the night too But it's harder to see when you're stuck in a dream here watching my channel welcome and if you are a subscriber I'm so glad to have you back I would love it if you are not subscribed if you would subscribe to my channel and hit that like button that really helps out my channel and helps me to continue to do more videos over here the clips for this video were leading up to a weekend of traveling. I don't know about you guys, but I really like to come home to a house that has clean laundry, clean sheets, and just generally decluttered and clean feeling around the house. So I definitely just wanted to make sure the house looked as good as possible for when we came home and threw all of our bags and suitcases on the ground. Before I try to reason with the devil Won't play a losing game I ain't about to set up I'm on an issue I'm the original Grab me a tissue The world's gone shallow But I, I've been wasting so much time Trying to figure out what
so the lighting in my closet is probably the worst lighting in the house. But that's where we're going to be. I am packing for this weekend. Connor is actually running a race this weekend. I am just packing up. We're actually going to go see Connor's grandparents, which are Riker's great grandparents. So we finally get to go see them. It's been a long time since we've seen them. I was going to show you guys what I kind of pack as a um, minimalist. I have this bag that I've always had. I would love to get like a new overnight bag, but because I've had this bag that I've had for almost eight years now. I'm really not dressing cute. I don't really have many clothes anyways. I am currently 20 weeks pregnant and I don't really have many clothes that fit me. So this is what I'm going to travel down in. This is just a maternity shirt from Target and some maternity shorts that I had from my son's pregnancy. I'm also going to wear the clothes that I'm bringing as PJs. This will probably be for the day back traveling the day back, just a shorts and a t-shirt combo. And I have another pair of shorts, t-shirt combo, but I also have one shirt that's kind of like quarter sleeve, kind of like this one. So um, just a couple options for Saturday. I'm bringing a dress for church because we will go to church on Sunday morning probably. So this is a maternity dress. I have, and I wore it with my son's pregnancy and I'm trying to get as much use as out of it as I can until winter comes. And then I'm also bringing a jacket. So, and it's just a little light jacket. I probably won't even need it. So the day that we're going down tomorrow, Friday night, we're gonna try to go to Connor's cousin's football game. So I'm dressing a little bit cuter for that as well. You know what, guys? I think I'm also gonna bring a hat. <laughs> Um, and then, of course, I have, like, sports bras, underwear, socks, all of those things. So that's pretty much all I'm packing for myself besides, like, my makeup and my curling iron and shampoo and conditioner and stuff. I probably won't bring a towel or anything like that. The jewelry I will bring will probably just be what I wear, which is probably going to be this. Um, I usually pack all of my cosmetics and stuff in this little travel bag. I do have Vera Bradley everything like i said it was from eight years ago i think this vera bradley trend is kind of out of style now it works so that's what i'm gonna bring later on i will pack for Riker. i have a doctor's appointment here pretty pretty soon so i'm gonna try to clean up before my mother-in-law gets here to watch Riker, and then i'll be back to pack his bag and get us ready to go someone's gonna love me right Is that 
I don't know if I mentioned this before, but we are packing for a weekend trip. So I just wanted to show you what I'm packing for my son. He is two. He doesn't really make a whole lot of messes anymore. So um, I used to pack like two to three changes of outfits just in case. I'm only packing one extra outfit for him. This is what I packed for him to come home in. Just a tank top and some shorts. It's still pretty hot here in Texas. We are wearing our summer clothes still. Tomorrow, there's a tech game going on, so of course I had to pack him a Texas Tech t-shirt and some shorts, just some play clothes, and then just an extra outfit for play clothes. What's up, Baba? Did you have a pumpkin? Um, I have a pair of jeans for him for church on Sunday, and another little uh, button-up shirt for him on church. For button up shirt for him for church and then I'm only packing him two pairs of PJs I don't think he's gonna need anything more than that that is it I am doing obviously socks pull-ups probably pack some diaper cream and some medicine he had strep throat this past week so we gotta pack all the medicine and stuff for that thermometer just in case we'll pack his sound machine his blankets and probably his pack and play, but he might be sleeping with us. And maybe like a monitor for nap time. Uh, I haven't really decided yet if I want to do that. Yeah, are you showing your pumpkin? Wait, I may also um, pack a couple of toys just in the diaper bag. And um, put some in the car as well. But that'll probably be the extent to the toys that I pack. He can play a lot outside while we're there. So it'll be super fun. Um, as you guys saw earlier, I was packing some food. So I'm packing... Quite a bit of food for him. I'm not really sure what Connor's grandparents are going to have at their house that he's going to like. So I'm packing some food for him. Also just to have some food for like the car and stuff. So I'm going to get to it. I got some questions for you, babe. I'm not trying to, trying to press you. I want to know what you would say. Of course, I didn't get everything done on my to-do list that I wanted to get done before this trip, but that is life and that is the reality of having a toddler and being pregnant at the same time. But I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope you will join me next week for another one. Bye. Bye.